Lusaka's George compound, a cholera-prone community, was not spared during one of Zambia's biggest outbreaks recently. As some of the members of this community went about business this morning, we posed this question. How receptive are they towards the idea of receiving a cholera vaccine? Opinions varied. In Lusaka alone, over one million people have been vaccinated against cholera. The Zambia National Public Health Institute has revealed that more vaccines will be available to the public soon. We have vaccines in country, um, the WHO vaccines, but then those ones are only given in emergency. Like if we confirm a case, that's when we can give. Mm. Um, and then the no is because we've been waiting for the Chinese vaccines, the, the three million doses that were promised. We're still waiting. Um, I had hoped that those would be in by October and would have had a big campaign, but I guess some of the, the shipment procedures that have delayed that. But mm. definitely once those come, then we'll be able to say we have for prevention and we also have for reaction. The Institute says a reported outbreak in some parts of Zimbabwe has ensured the increased surveillance on border towns. So that we are aware of what's going on on the Zim side. The, the, the outbreak was mostly in like a fishing village which had poor access obviously to, to water and sanitation. Mm. They have discharged all their patients at the moment and so it has been controlled. And then on the Zambian side there were no cases reported but we made sure that we've sent them chlorine and in oral, uh, oral rehydration salts. So far, no confirmed cases of cholera have been recorded. Penlopsikazwe, ZNBC News, Lusaka.